All right, now I'm making the roof. And it's going right here. It's gonna be a piece of wood there and there. So I have to make this front piece with a really slow, really shallow slope on it. And that's this piece here. So I have to cut it at a really kind of a funny angle, which is hard to do on a table saw. Cause how do you, I mean, what do you put it against? So I'm taking this little block of wood, screwing it on there, and then you can hold it against the fence at an angle and run it through. Okay, it immediately became apparent that the uh, fence here was too short, and when this part got past, you know, it screw up the angle. So I screwed this other piece of wood on, so that will sit right against the fence to go all the way through, and it worked pretty good. And this is just screwed in once up here. It's not even screwed in here, it just holds. So I'll screw this in at the other end and do the same thing. Voila! So here's the roof partly put together. Here's the next board, and I cut it at an angle so that when, oops, when they meet up, they're flush. And I'm gonna screw it. All right, here's a trick people might be interested in. I uh, drilled a hole in here before when I wasn't paying attention. Uh, you know, I have no excuse. Uh, but I'm gonna make some wood filler with some sawdust and some glue. Let me mix it up first. All right, so here's my glue and sawdust mixed together. I'm going to take a little bit and stuff it in there. But this is kind of weird doing this looking through the camera screen instead of at it for real. Anyway, that'll fix your hole. Here's the bottom of the lid, and all that's left is strip of wood here and strip of wood there that will fit around the outside of the whole thing. Roof complete, and I screwed it in from this side so that on the top there'd be no screw holes here. Well, there are over there because that piece was uh, a little bit thick to drill. I guess I could have drilled holes, but I didn't. Maybe I'll do that on the other one since I'm about to build a whole other beehive, a second one. Hopefully this one will go a lot faster. And the roof even fits. Four and a half hours later, one, two beehives, two roofs, all the sticky things to go on top. And I just need to use this to glue the windows in and put the screen in. But I'll do that later tonight. Right now, I'm going to go take advantage of the sun and go work on the tower. Battery. Oh, I have one down here. Yeah, I know. So it appears that um, Jamie is creating the um, anchorages for the doorway to lead upstairs. Are you looking at my shorts? Um, yes, nice penis, by the way. Okay, so all these joists are in, and now we're gonna put floorboards on top. Uh, I'll have to take these out as I go. And here's the four floorboards, two by 12s. And uh, here's this character holding the rope, which goes all the way up there and down the other side and is attached to one of those. And uh, we're both gonna have to pull it up because those are pretty heavy. Ah, uh, okay, let's get to work. This is a little scary. I don't, I don't know if I really want to do this. <laughs> <laughs> it, once you get up here, you can put your hand and it's a lot more stable. Um. <laughs> Hi. So here's the tower floor looking much more secure than before when there was nothing here. And there's the ground way down there. Ooh. I wonder if it comes out kind of scary on camera. But uh, here's the view around here. It's pretty cool. And there's the house <laughs> way down there. Oh, and there's my beautiful truck, which still has a giant robot in it. Oh my God, do you see there's a giant robot in that truck? That's so cool. All right, it's starting to get dark and there goes the sun. We're going to have dinner. Say, Say bye. Bye.